Yo, I got a question for y'all, man. I got a question. Why? What? When a company says observed, right? They observe a holiday. Why are they letting you know that? For no reason. Okay, so. Okay, y'all, we had a meeting, right? And and y'all watched my videos before. For those who haven't watched my videos, I'm a merchandiser. And we had a meeting, right? And the meeting had nothing to do with us. 90% had to do with the other RSRs, you know, with the higher up people that, you know, they scan and all that other fancy shit they order. So I was ignoring it for the most part. But if there's one part I did listen to, there was a part that said that, like, when it came up, the lady was like, and here's a list of all the observed holidays, which I paid attention to. I was like, holy shit, observed, you know? I'm thinking that they're letting us know that the reason why they observe is because we should have off on those days. Because why else would you have a list and take time out of the day in a meeting to let us know that it's observed? So I'm like, oh, okay, well, shit. And I see like a huge list. I'm like, oh, damn, we, we fucking balling. Like, it was like, you know, 15 of them. I can't name all of them, but, you know, there was Christmas, of course. And then there was no New Year's. And there was Columbus Day. And there was, uh, there was, uh, you know, a, a couple other ones. And I was like, oh, Hanukkah, I think it was. I was like, oh, man. You know, so I'm thinking we're off, right? I'm thinking we're off because there's no way they would just let us know about all these holidays and spend like five minutes on a board, you know. So I send her a message, right? And I ask her today because I was like, wait a second. Because I was, I was in the mental mindset that I was off on Wednesday because that's New Year's, right? So I send her a message. I send my manager a message. I say, excuse me, madam. Okay, I didn't say that, but I say, excuse me, her name. And I'm like, are we off? Uh, and then I was like, uh, what holidays do we have off? Um, because, you know, I, like, if you have that list that they showed in the meeting, can you send it to me? And she said, oh, no, no. The only holiday that you have off is Christmas. All ho other holidays are observed, but if you're scheduled to come in on those days, you still are required to come in and work your shift. I didn't respond to her, and I was like, "What the fuck? What what, what the fuck is observed then? Then, man, I sound a country right there. I said, then, what the what the hell? I, mean, I might as well be country. I mean, what the hell's going on? I mean, y'all, what? Why why were they letting us know? Why were they letting us know that that holiday? those holidays are observed like what's the point of letting us know that then like oh just to let us know that oh yes we as a company know that these holidays exist i mean what the fuck does okay what does that have to do with me like, like what does that mean like why are you letting me know it's observed for i mean hell like you know what's the manager the ceo of the company gonna do are they gonna take a, a magnifying glass and put their eye to it and say oh we observe this day what am i gonna do oh I'm gonna get a specialized email from the company on uh, on um, I'm gonna get a specialized email from the company on Wednesday, letting me know that uh, you know you um, you know that we observe this day. Happy New Year! Like fuck! Like why? Why? See, they got my hopes up, man. They got my hopes up. That's why I'm making this damn video. They got my hopes up. I was like, oh man, bet I'm gonna have another three days off. Cause I was like, I had today off, which is the start of the week officially, Sunday. Sunday to Saturday is the week period. So I was like, bet I'm gonna have another three days off. I'm gonna have today off. And then I was like, bet I'm gonna have, uh, I'm gonna go in Monday, Tuesday, and then I'm gonna be off on Wednesday for New Year's. And I'm off on my Thursday on my normal scheduled day off. Kind of like last week. Was it last week or was it this week? The 25th? Uh, yeah, last week. Yeah. Cause I had three days off last week. I had Sunday. And I had, uh, I went to work Monday and I went to work, I did a 12 hour shift Tuesday. And then I worked Wednesday and Thursday. Oh, who's this white girl? Wait a minute, she's pretty. I gotta put my, gotta put my glasses on for this one. Is she pretty? Oh shit. Oh, never mind. She looks like a drug head. But y'all, so anyway, oh, that's fucked up. I shouldn't say that. But y y hey, she looks like she fucking does cocaine. But y'all, I'm like, what the fuck is going on here? What is she doing? Like she walk is she looking at what I'm doing? You want to be in the video? She just fucking staring at me. What you think I'm gonna do? Run a heist on the apartment? Oh, man, white people. Y'all listen, 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 man. Listen. I ain't racist, y'all, but they be something else, man. 
motherfuckers be looking at you. Oh, she got in her car. I heard like a huge thud. I was like, I know she just didn't hit my car. But y'all, like, okay, what I was trying to say. Now she's looking at me as she's driving off. Go away, damn it. But like, what I was trying to say, I'm pissed. Why? Why? Not? Why would you let us know in the middle of an important, important meeting that these are the observed holidays? Like, bitch, I observe it too. I under, I, I look at my calendar. Like, what the hell? I thought I was gonna have off on third. I mean, I was gonna have another two days back to back. I thought I was gonna have off on Columbus Day and Veterans Day. Well, nah, nah, nah. A dude went on a rant about that one in that meeting. As a matter of fact, he was pissed. So why was he bitching then? Is what I'm trying to understand. Cause he was bitching. He was he was pissed off. Like he stood up. Like he not stood up. But like he like you know got straight in his chair. He was like, <clears throat> I've got a, something to say about this. And everybody was like, Oh shit, here you go again. And he was like, he crossed his arms. He was like, I don't know why. As a company, we don't uh, we observe. Columbus Day, but we don't observe Veterans Day. There are veterans out there who risk their lives and put their lives on the line every day. And I've got family who are veterans. And, you know, I, it, is, it upsets me that we observe Columbus Day, which shouldn't even exist, but we don't observe Veterans Day. And everybody in the room was like, yeah, 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 we, you know, we agree, yeah, yeah. And so I'm thinking like, oh, he's right. We should be off of work Veterans Day and we can work on Columbus Day because it's fucking Columbus Day. So he was just bitching just a bitch then. Is that, is that, is that, am I, am I, am I getting this right? He was just complaining just to say that, yeah, we should acknowledge. He was just talking about the, that the company should acknowledge that Veterans Day exists. He didn't care about having off on Veterans Day. He just wanted the day to be acknowledged. And he wanted Columbus Day to not be acknowledged. Why does that fucking matter? Like, why does that matter to somebody? Like, why? Why does it matter that the company doesn't like what? I, I, I'm confused. <clears throat> I'm confused so damn much my voice is cracking. I'm confused, man. I want it off on Wednesday. No, I want it off. Yeah, I want it off on Wednesday. You see, me and my mom have this tradition. I, you know, I go over her house. Y'all might, this is not probably a common tradition among families or someone, one of your loved ones. We have a tradition. You know, I always go over her house and at, you know, 1150, you know, we make, we get sparkling cider and shit. And, you know, we wait until the ball drops on New Year's. I mean, up in New York, you know, we watch it on the TV. And as they're counting down, you know, me and my mom, we grab champagne glasses and we toast. And right when the ball drops, it's 2020, happy new year. You know, we toast to the new year. So now you're telling me I have to wake up. I have to be to work at 3 a.m. Excuse me. I have to put my glasses back on. So now I have to be to work at 3 a.m. So that means on Tuesday, after a grueling nine and a half hour shift, you're telling me that I have to hurry up and go home and take a nap and get some sleep. Because that means that if I want to observe the new year with my mom, that means that if I didn't go to sleep when I got home, that means that I'd have to spend, that means that I would only get like a good two hours, of, no, not even two hours. Because let's just say I went and I went to work nine and a half hours right on Tuesday. And then, you know, fucking, see, these glasses make me look weird. Why does it look like, I look like fucked up. It makes my eyes look like I, but anyway, so that means that I will only get two hours of sleep down. Because if I observed it with, you know, I, you know, champagne time, and then I went back home, I didn't go to bed until, let's say, 12.30, 12.45, I'd have less than two hours of sleep in total for another nine-hour shift on Wednesday, on New Year's, because I, since I work on New Year's, apparently. So that means I'd have to actually get home from, you know, and get home at like 12.30, 1 p.m., right? And I have to take a nap just so I can get enough sleep and then when I wake up head over to my mom's house and then come back and try to get some additional sleep for Wednesday so the moral of this video I got groceries in the back that's why I'm in my car right now I got the air conditioner on I don't know why it is cold as shit outside I got the air conditioner on I want to be sub-zero for some reason let me turn the heat back on but you know so the moral of this video is why companies stop stop getting your employees hopes up maybe i'm retarded maybe i'm the dumb one 
Let me on the stupid one. Is this is this is this policy for all companies to do? Is this policy for all companies to do just to let you know that these are the days that we observe it? I mean, why is that so special? Why would I care is the question. Why would I give a damn if you observe the holiday? Shit, I observe a lot of things. I'm observing a tree right now. I'm observing this phone while I'm recording it. I'm observing this blue SUV that's to my right. I'm like, okay, congratulate. Why are you telling me that you observe something if there's, if there's no, like, result from it? Like, man, I got so excited. I thought I had off on all those holidays. We, on, we about to be on vacation soon, though, boys. Damn, it's unprofessional as shit. I'm going to have to ask my manager what, because I just, I wanted a, a, a vacation as soon as possible. So what I did, I got a vacation coming up on my birthday when I turn 24. I'm getting old. When I turn on the 18th, on that week, I've got a vacation. And then I've got my, I got, you get two weeks, which is fucking stupid. I'm not going to even go on a rant about how dumb a nine to five job is. Because, you know, we got the entrepreneur mind set up on this YouTube channel. I'm not going to even go into that conversation. But, you know, we get two weeks. So, and I think it's better be fucking paid. I'm going to have to message her and ask her. I completely forgot. She sent me a message. And she said it was, I, I, I made another one in January. Everybody took up a week in January. So, I chose, I think, like the last week of January or something like that. I think my... Other vacation ends on like the 29th and it starts on like, I can't even remember. I think it like starts on like the 20, the 24th or something, 24th or 23rd, something like that. Damn, I forgot. what I completely forgot. I'm going to have to ask, actually message her and ask her when my vacation is because I didn't pay attention to that. Now you would think me, I, out of everyone, I would make sure I would know what days I'm off, but I don't even know anymore. I'd have to actually message her and say, when's my, she probably might lie and shit, be like, oh, you work this week, knowing damn well. But y'all, that's the end of the video. I, I meant to make like a two minute rant, it's been 12 minutes, I gotta hurry up and get this ice cream in the house. I got the heat on too, this ice cream's gonna melt, man. Damn it. And then I'm gonna be carrying the ice cream up the steps. It happens if the ice cream start leaking out the damn, the thing. It's gonna look like I shit myself, but it look, but the chocolate's gonna be like on my pants. So it's gonna look like, it's gonna look like you know my penis uh, shit comes out of that. So people are gonna be like, wow, he's shitting out of his front, not his back. And then they're gonna report me to the FBI, and then they're gonna do experiments on me, which is fine because if the FBI does experiments on me, that means they can, I can, that means I won't have to be at work. Because, you know, they'll be like, wow, why does he shit out of his penis and piss out of his asshole? That's what they'll think, but they won't know that it was just chocolate ice cream that melted on my pants while I was coming up the steps. But that's okay, because then I can message my manager or and call them and say, well, you know, I had to take some time away from work because the FBI is experimenting on me. So I'll be off of work, you know what I'm saying? So with that being said, y'all... It's been 13 minutes now, so I have to get into the house, so I'll catch y'all later.